I'm using them to do handy things. So why not tell people that that's what I'm doing? I can talk to the person, be honest, why not? I've done many stories on dating in New York City and told you that Tinder is really a necessity to get the dating work done. But I had no idea that it was a way to get your household work done. I'm here down here on the Lower East Side to meet Fiona Bloom, who figured out that precious gem and hear all about her technique. If I use Tinder and meet guys that I'm not attracted to, but can help me do other things, whether it promote shows, which I have down the street right now, or helping me with something handy around the house, why not? Now, to be fair, Fiona says she does it for the men as well. They want to feel needed. They want to feel like there's something, you know, there's no actual connection there initially. Maybe they do all these cool things for you, and eventually you're like, oh, I really like him. Why had I not thought of this before? And then I realized I had. I did a story about Rent-A-Gent, and part of that site is that ladies use those men to do everything from their dishes to running their daily errands. Seems like I've been missing out, and this is just the way that I should date. I would just say, listen, you know, um, you seem really sweet. What are you doing this weekend? I actually need a few things taken care of. Primarily, my door needs fixing. What do you think? Want to come over? And But then how do you let them know, but there'll be no exchange of... Because you know. it's a first time, it's a first date. Guys should never ever even assume or think that they're gonna get some. Amen to that. So that's it, right? Amen. 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 All right, thank you very much. <laughs> thank you.